It's with us, version 10.2 of Mailstore Server, your favorite email archiving software. It's here, and today we're gonna to take a look at what's new in it. So if you're not familiar, there's a few different ways you can access your email in Mailstore. You've got an Outlook add-in, you've got a desktop client, and you've also got the web client. Well, it's the web client that's completely new in this version of Mailstore, and that's what we're going to look at. So rather than just talk about it, I'm going to dive straight in and uh, show you around. So here we are at the login screen. Here, I'll just enter my details using one password. So typing them in. And as you can see immediately, you've got this nice, clean, clear, responsive new web client interface. Here, you can browse your folder structures. Um, new to this version, I can create a folder. I'll call it BAT2. I can move a folder, so you can see there it's a, a subfolder. I can move that to the root. Okay. And if I want to, I can merge those. So all I need to do is call that the same name, and it will prompt me, I hope. Yeah, it prompts me to merge. In terms of searching, I'll show you. I'll just do a quick search for a uh, channel publication, save showing anything particularly sensitive. Um, and you can see here, this gives you your results, and that's a full HTML view. Um, as you'd expect, all the kind of search criteria that you'd expect to see in Mail Store, so subject, message body, attachment, searching, and then you can save that search. So I just click save and call that E to E. And yeah, that's a save search. I can run quickly if I've got some that are, some that are common. So with a message selected, I can restore that to a mailbox. I can move it to a folder just as I could previously in the other view, or I can open as an MSG or an EML file. Uh, also, of course, this is responsive. That's one of the main selling points here. So this is the view you'll see on a tablet or a smartphone. And then you've got little buttons up here for searching and for browsing the archive. And then that's your, that's your user settings. Okay, so it's basically the web client that I really wanted to show you, but there are some other points to note in this latest release of Mailstore. Um, it now digitally signs exports, which uh, basically means if you go to export a load of mail, you can show when it reaches the other end that the integrity is, is perfectly intact. It hasn't been changed in any way. Um, and there's also uh, the introduction of reporting. So schedule reports for the service provider edition of Mailstore. I'll put some links in the description for you to check out there. Uh, and that's about it. I'll wrap up now. Don't forget, hit subscribe and like the video if you feel so inclined. Okay, cheers. Yeah.